Okay, so we got our barrel in. Uh, it's a Bear Creek Arsenal barrel assembly. And it was $81.07. And it comes with everything on it. Wait, we'll open it up here on camera so you can see. And then, uh, so we're going to have a total of, it was $91.07 with shipping. So right now we've got, without tax and, and or shipping or anything, we've got $205.92 into this build. With shipping uh, and or taxes, we've got $222.18 in it. So we'll go ahead and get this open so we can take a look at it. I have not opened this obviously, and so I have no idea what to expect. Uh, 8107, I, I had to jump on that deal. Uh, I've never dealt with uh, Bear Creek Arsenal, so I'm definitely going to do a headspace and everything on this check when I build it. Figure this out here. Oh wow, the front slight post running is already mounted to it. Nice. Let me get this off the trap. Okay, so apparently I turned off the camera when I was taking it off the tripod and didn't turn it back on when I was giving a close-up of the barrel. Uh, everything came installed on the barrel, the uh, front sight post. Uh, it's got a bayonet lug on it. Uh, the muzzle brake, muzzle device was already installed, the delta ring so it went really good I'm impressed with the finish and everything on it it is, see if I can get it on here wrong way chambered in 5.568 over the 1.7 twist and I used my hand guard and my front sight pose or my uh, carry handle uh, you can get carry handles for 20 bucks and the hand guards, I believe, are like 16 with the dual heat shields in them. Uh, you can get rear sights for as little as, I'll see them for as little as $10. So we can add that onto it after the build. And I'll probably use one of my butt stocks. Um, obviously, budget build of 400 or less, it's not going to do any good if the rifle doesn't function. So once I get my bolt carrier group, which I'd like to try an Ames surplus BCG, I've been wanting to try one. Uh, they're about ten dollars more than the uh, Palmetto State Armories are. I've used uh, PSA before, and they're—I've never had an issue with their bolt carriers. So I don't know which way I'll go there. And then I thought about doing an A2 uh, stock on there, or A1 or A2 style stock on it, which is like about sixty dollars. So I'd like to get this done within a month. So if you see this video in that time, let me know what you think I should do. I don't know if it'll go over budget or not. We'll see with what bolt carrier group and I meant to get a name surplus or I meant to get a uh, charging handle as a name surplus and I forgot about it until I actually started doing this video so there you go one other thing it does the barrel did have the uh, M4 feed ramps on it I don't know if you can see that in there or not 